electricity. That's the way it should be. Come in here for a moment and we... Few people are cognizant of the many problems faced by a band director and his assistants in the preparation of a Rose Bowl show. Chief of these, of course, in my estimation, is the problem of just getting a brand new idea for a production of this type. Maybe we ought to go over into the area of ecology and do something, uh, well, we just gave it a rough title here called Every Living Thing. Birds and bees and fishes and... The other day, uh... You sketched out four stick figures, you know, connecting hands. Right. Remember Can we I use that? Sure. We drew the uh, idea of something of this sort. Here are the people of the world, and I think if we dissolve the two outside figures and then bring their hands Connect together. Hands. Okay. Yeah. Is there some only. danger in dispersing our sound here, or can we get our usual big sound by bringing well, them together? Let me tell you, it's going to be dangerous. That's part of your job. Oh, okay, thanks. <laughs> The question is often asked, how do more than 200 bandsmen know where they're going? The Michigan Marching Band uses the chart system. Each individual receives a chart which gives him information concerning music played and when to play it, when to march and when to stop, where to go and how to get there. After I get the music and formation ideas, it takes approximately three to four days to plan, produce, and compile charts for the whole band. Many bands use commercial arrangements of music. But at the university level, most bands have their own arranger who is an integral part of the show planning and who gives the band a distinctive musical character. Exactly what we want. Hey, how about birds, bees, and flowers? You get any ideas? I set this out. This is a flight of bumblebee. Houseman, drop it up, forward. of the assistant director in field drill is somewhat unique. He's an extension of the director's eyes, ears, hands, and mouth. Okay. Quiet, please. All these diagonals should be equal distant spacing. <laughs> Initial rehearsals are crucial in learning formation positions and transitions. The formation charts give directions as to field positions. Each bandsman must adjust these instructions during the first two rehearsals. Inclement weather, darkness, and scheduling all pose problems. Hey, you're doing this without horns now. That's me. You got horns up 
Keep listening. We've got a lot of people in a small room. Be alert. Now we'll try it right now. You're brand new to the score. We'll watch all those repeats and the DC. Here we are, gentlemen. Are you ready? Yeah. I don't hear you. Are you ready? Yeah. Huh. There we go. Gentlemen, we're about ready to uh, embark on really a, one of the thrills of a lifetime. There are a few of you who have made this trip twice, but not many of you. You'll get one chance probably to march in that Rose Bowl and show the world what kind of a band we have. We have a dedication to excellence, a dedication to excellence in tone, a dedication to excellence in intonation, in rhythm, in blend, in balance, in our marching, in our conduct, in our dress. We're not trying to beat anybody else. The only guy we're trying to beat is ourselves out there with greater standards than we've ever had. I'm going to turn you over now to our drum major, Mark Brown. Mark? Here on the UCLA campus, we've begun the process of detailed field drill all over again. Every person's location relative to distance and interval must be minutely checked. Now, gentlemen, you wasted two minutes right here. I said come to midfield, play one note, and then we go in on drums. So we've now wasted almost three minutes. Catch that step off on wide, wonderful. It's a hard one. <laughs> Yeah. 
perfection is the goal in the marching as well as the playing. To achieve this, of course, requires great concentration and superb physical conditioning. We usually feel we have to have at least one hour of field drill for every 30 seconds of actual show, which will mean a total of over 7,000 man hours for this production. Gentlemen, put it in that concert formation now for the feature. That's what you're playing. Impact on the first note you turn. Impact on the first note you step. Precision, perfection, 100%. Go. that kind of an up. Oh. Gonna accept that kind of an up. Huh. No impact because somebody's not counting and they come in like this instead of da da the right way and the wrong way. There's only one way it's right. Second whole knot is not together and it's not tongue. slow two. Now the second major after V, be sure to put the pulse on the beat. Dee, da, da. All right, slow two. Here we go. Separate. Style. Sectional rehearsals in the band call for the performers to put in extra time and effort, often late at night.
three pickups after the tie, pulse on the beat. Dee, da, dee, da, da. Dee, da, dee, da, da. Once again from the beginning, a little faster. Pool rehearsal stress perfection in tone, intonation, rhythm, and phrasing. Sectionals emphasize every individual's responsibility to achieve perfection in these areas. I think any group which is outstanding has to have first and foremost probably a great amount of self-discipline. Discipline, as you know, comes in many forms and shapes. Vince Lombardi achieved it one way and Casey Stengel in another. And I guess I achieve it in my own particular way. But it's one of the key factors. Discipline coupled with dedication. I've got just the greatest bunch of men in the whole United States, and I don't care who knows it. That's exactly the way I, I believe, and I've told them that, and they have responded that way for me this season. We've had one of the greatest marching and playing seasons we've ever had at Michigan, and uh, I attribute it all to those 215 great guys that I work with every day. I've got the greatest job in the United States. I wouldn't trade jobs with the president right now. Whenever the band is on the move, logistics are a special problem, and it requires a large van just to carry all of our equipment. When we perform, whether on the gridiron or here at Disneyland, the musical aspects of our show must come first. We try to tune as carefully as if we were in Carnegie Hall.
Five tennis balls, tennis. there's a great parallel between the football team and the band. Both must have great discipline and dedication, and each must have the highest standards of execution to win. And they both place themselves before the public in an evaluation of their capabilities. To both, the Rose Bowl is the culmination of their efforts. Oh, 
symbolic of the beauty of life than flowers and the beautiful Tournament of Roses parade. But sometimes man forgets that all living things have the right to grow and prosper. finally be able, unselfishly, to share our world. 